Hi, Elmo. What are you doing? Oh, hi, Miss Twista. Elmo can't find his puppy Tango. Oh, maybe I can help. Tango! Tango! Tango, where are you? <coughs> oh, she's in the bookshelf. Oh, Tango, there you are. <laughs> Tango, do you want to hear a story? Okay, Tango, why don't you pick one out? Ooh, that's a good choice. Hey, there's a dog on the cover, but it doesn't look like Tango. No, but I can still read it anyway. Dog was a dog, and that's what everyone called him. Dog. Just dog. Morning, dog. Hello, dog. Get down, dog. Come on, dog. And dog didn't like it. He moped by the fire. Dog's not a name, he said to Midnight the Cat. Not a proper name. It's just something that says I'm not a cat. Well, you're not a cat, said Midnight. No, said Dog. But I'm not just another dog either. And it's time they knew it. Dog got to his feet, slipped out of the back door, and began to dig up the garden. Have you gone crazy? said Midnight. What are you doing? Digging, said Dog. Because when I've dug more holes than any dog in history... They'll stop calling me Dog and start calling me Digger. But they didn't start calling him Digger, and they didn't stop calling him Dog. Bad Dog was all they said. Now what are you going to do? asked Midnight. Bark, said Dog. That's what I'm going to do. I'm going to bark so loud and so long They'll stop calling me Dog and start calling me Barker. <coughs> but they didn't start calling him Barker, and they didn't stop calling him Dog. Be quiet, Dog, was all they said, and they put him on his leash. Now what are you going to do, Dog, said Midnight. Chew, of course, said Dog. That's what I'm going to do. Chew through my leash and get through the fence and chase more policemen than any dog in history. And then they'll have to stop calling me dog and start calling me Switfoot or Lionheart or Hunter. <sighs> but they didn't start calling him Swiftfoot or Lionheart or Hunter. And they didn't stop calling him Dog. Oh, Dog, oh, Dog, oh, Dog, was all they said. And now what are you going to do, Dog, said Midnight. Think, said Dog. And that's when he came up with a plan. First, he rolled over and made big I'm sorry eyes and gave long I'm sorry licks. Then he tidied the garden, was nice to the postman, fetched all the slippers, didn't bark at the neighbor's chickens, and collected the newspapers. He didn't run quickly through the house, but curled up quietly by the fire with a deep and meaningful I am the best dog ever sigh. And that's when they started. Good dog, they said. Good, good dog. In fact, you're such a good dog. We want to give you a good dog's name. Like Sweetheart. 
or honey bun, or treasure chest, or pudding face, or sugar pops, or angel eyes. And that's when Dog couldn't help it. He leapt to his feet, ran quickly through the house, and jumped on the sofa, barking his head off. No, no, you've got this whole thing wrong. Just Dog suits me fine. The end. I just received a text from your mom. She wants you to come home for dinner. Aw, does Elmo have to? Yes, Elmo has to. Oh, okay. Hop in my car. I'll drive you home. Oh, that's okay, Miss Crystal. Elmo will just ask the rock runner to give him and Tango a ride home. Come on, Tango. Bye-bye, <coughs> Miss Crystal. Bye-bye. <laughs>